Yes, now let's go to do the second video inside the house. So this is the main entrance, as I said. So we'll go in now and see what we have there. Start from, I suppose, beautiful, beautiful living room. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's hot outside. So I'm just moving a bit before start show you the windows and the doors just came in too. You can see it's a nice patio doors, door there, open, open this one as well. And all this is faced to the lovely, lovely garden, as you can see. Yeah, and I will have a seat on this sofa for a while so I can show you what I see when I'm relaxing in the property living room. You just watch the garden, beautiful. And if you put over there a swimming pool, it will be wonderful as well. And you see the nice small forest with a little stream below the trees. And have a look here, what we have. We have this nice spacious living room. There's not a lot of traditional Bulgarian houses with such a big white living room. Most of them are with different premises on the ground floor. So the builders and the owners knock, remove the walls to try to make it wider and open plan. And it's, <clears throat> sorry, and it's proper open plan, but the width is not like many other houses. This one is really, really impressed me. So look at it. I'm just quick look. It's a nice, wide, spacious. You can catch this from the video, definitely. Look at, I'll just show a proper size, wonderful, lovely, spacious living room. And it's bright because of all these patio, because of all these patio doors here. And you can see it's really well done, painted properly, beautiful, nice, high ceilings. You can see no any signs of problems at all, but you already see in the roof, I did show you so. Every of these premises are really a lot of bet a good done job with a spent a lot of money. You can see the, the tiles, there's a floor tiles, proper floor tiles, good quality. I like them and I like the colors, I like a peach color. And here in the corner, we have a wonderful stove, which is, believe it or not, is very powerful. And this one can keep this, all this premise here, because it's the living room there, the dining table the area is there, and the kitchen is there. But this one can heat in a, like, late autumn months, like October, November, can heat this premise properly, and you maybe don't need to use the pellet burner for the for the the pellet burner for 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 that uh, when the temperature is not that much cold look at this beautiful i'm just keep quiet and show it look at the space you have this lovely corner here so somebody can enjoy even to put a television here and can enjoy this corner behind this small wall you have another corner you have all these sides here as well so for me, this is a really good decision and this is cost money to make it and convert it all traditional Bulgarian house to that white premises because you are going to see now the dining area, amazing, the kitchen area, amazing. I like all of them. Now I'm here and I'll take all the lights on for you. Okay, so what we have here, the same floor tile. This lovely arch is lead us to the beautiful, beautiful dining area with another patio door. I like this decision. It's architectural building decision. It's perfect to have a lovely patio door to the dining area as well. So you can enjoy, while we enjoy your food, you can enjoy the garden, the beautiful garden. Like while you're relaxing in the living room, you can enjoy the beautiful garden as well. So look at this. I'll just show you how nice and wild white it is okay look at this beautiful beautiful double glazed it's really good yeah the thickness of these double glazed windows is really good one yeah and a lovely garden again and beautiful 
tiger table you can see the walls everything is painted different color good quality of a stuff really good quality of the stuff a lot of money has been spent in this house believe it or not a lot so you can see there is a radiator everywhere like one here and I think one or two in the living room let's have a quick look and see again it's one over there and one here so this is comes from the pellet burner we've just been to the pellet burner outside and now it's time to show the kitchen this is what a lot of a lot of people ask me for we're looking for a house with a beautiful standard but, and please could you please show us a nice big kitchen because a lot of houses we've seen are with a big proper size of room but the kitchens are really small so this one I think is one of the best size kitchen I can see look at this nicely job done tells everything I like it you know hang on pans and stuff cooking stuff and the countertop look at the countertop it's a good quality countertop thickness I like the cupboards the kitchen is brand new by the way it's been done just a few months ago and this is a gas hob but this is with a gas tank at the back you know at the bottom it's not the gas supply village you know but yeah, there's no gas supply villages maybe only a few of them I like the quality of the work has been done look at this yeah little touches I like it tiles proper proper back tiles and a lot of cupboards down below the countertop you can see which is a nice as well because it's easier for everyone doesn't matter how hey how tall the person who is doing the cooking is if there is no upper cupboard there's always good to have more below so there's thousands of them here you can see how many cupboards really good job really good job has been done I like this one and the other thing is when you have no up cupboard it still make a space for you and you not feel like pressed pressed from the from the ceilings because it's a good quality of the ceiling high ceilings extractor everything let's have a quick look again on the dining area okay the living area here as well beautiful beautiful I like this really good decision and really cost money this decision let's have a look to see the utility room which very handy it's just next to the kitchen and dining area so you have all these white goods here and again proper height of the ceiling you have a lot of sockets electric sockets which is very handy washing machines attached here dry washer as well so everything and you have a simple kitchen we covered so we can do some work here well, wash another radiator for the heating system it's really nice there is a door here which is missing in the moment but everyone can put it back if they want so this is an option to be closed if you want the same nice styling beautiful beautiful look at this I really in impressed really impressed usually when I'm impressed I'm repeating and repeating and repeating so it's make people maybe to think that I'm crazy or I'm just uh, speechless but because I don't want to stop talking that's why I'm repeating <laughs> okay let's go and have a look what we have down there which is very curious and then we'll go to see what is there up there okay so for now we have in one floor we have this lovely living room with the lovely sitting uh, dining area with amazing kitchen utility room there so this is what we have on the ground floor I suppose it's now clear from the ground floor this is the door we came in from the garden obviously you can see from the ground floor we have this access with a few steps down there which obviously used to be the cellar of the old house of the main house before the work to be done in this property now here this was a typical Bulgarian traditional house cellar what is being done here amazing look at this beautiful I like I will stop talking for a while just because I just feel how cool it's here really cool because it's hot while outside and just I came into here and it's a super proper temperature this temperature 
is the same during the winter. This is what the advantage of the stone walls and the built in the ground cellar is. Now, beautiful, beautiful, another, what I can say, this is just like another living room here. Can you imagine how big house, huge house, and every premise is white, white enough, I can say. Look at the beams. They've been very well looked after. Painted, nice, treated properly. You can look at them. Wonderful job has been done. I like this. I like the way they keep the style, make it to look nice. All the old features for the time being done are kept nice and white. Paint, the same time, looked after everything. Look at this. I like that type of construction. You can have a look, imagine how good it is. Nice and clean, smell absolutely dry, absolutely dry, beautiful. And to be honest, it's not that much height, but it's proper height. I'm 1.76 centimeters, which for me is perfect. <clears throat> look at that. I like them. Beams are wonderful. All the originals. I like them and now have a look at the touches of everything so we came from there entrance proper tiles you can have a look and see the tiles no any signs of a wet spots of the tiles at all at all nice corner has been done over there as well good color walls one radiator there and another radiator here okay which is also connected to the pellet burner which pellet burner is by the way behind this wall okay so you know where we are now and beautiful beautiful nice areas it's really proper white proper proper white living room what else this could be done is another beautiful stove which can heat this premise during the days when the temperature is not that much high but it's not that much cold just to make it nice and homey look at this this one here could be a ground floor bedroom because with this size of here and with the living room you have there you have two big living rooms so by my opinion this one could be could be a beautiful beautiful bedroom with a office as well beautiful cool look at the thickness of the walls i want to show you how thick the walls is stone walls look at how thick is the tiled wall and you have a bit more over there as well really nice really really nice look at this and to be honest to be honest it's bright enough even without the lights on yeah, see, for the summer, it's not that much bad. It's not a typical cellar small windows. You have two that size windows, which give some light during the day as well. So it's not that much dark. So it's a very good place to relax and watch your football matches or watch what you want. You know, the wife television, the husband television. They still sitting next to each other, showing their love. But at the same time, she's watching her own movies he is watching his own movies so they got their privacy but at the same time they are sitting next to each other lovely isn't it <laughs> okay let's go and have a look and see what we have above because we have about three proper size bedrooms we will be surprised how good size they are okay okay we go here now we just quick reminder we've been there which we came from the garden we've been down there now this is the living room we go from the living room on this side so we have a nice nicely done uh, tile steps with a beautiful railing simple one good decision i like simple things here we are in a can you imagine how wide the corridor is this house has no any premise to be less than large one i can say they are large for bulgarian standards properties really large premises each one toilet bathrooms corridor living room dining area kitchen wet room 
downstairs where we've been to the office and uh, another living room everything is wide enough so you have no any narrow corridors to push you to feel you stressed or whatever look at this beautiful nice painted walls you can see them beautiful job look at it beams everything i like the steps coming to the corridor the, the, the corridor and it's really good because you have about one two three four five six steps higher level the bedroom area which for me is really good it keeps the bedroom a bit far away from the living room so what does it mean for me is maybe i'm looking and uh, telling this because of my experience with bulgarian way but when i was a child and when i was living in an apartment and i my parents has guests and they have a party and enjoy till the late night whatever and when i went to my bedroom to sleep i always can hear them and i can't sleep it properly that's from my that point of view it's good because you have six steps down there going to a proper living room even below these rooms here down there is the other living room and it's put a bit on site even if the people are enjoying the party and whatever the bedroom still is upstairs nice and quiet okay so we did see now the the corridor beautiful one look at this access to the ceiling to the roof and beams i like the doors they kept all the doors frames the nice door frames put them here good quality street back street windows radiator nice job nice job wonderful laminated floor everyone can change with a tiles one if they want so what we have here let me go back from the start of the bedroom area this is the corridor let's go to see first room on the left so to be clear for people about the about the layout so this bedroom sorry but do i hear anyone to say it's a small bedroom no you have this big wardrobe you can see where the wall is it's deep wardrobe and then you have all this stuff here which is just looked like the bedroom is small but it's not it's just a proper 4x4 four four, nearly 16 maybe 18 square meters proper bedroom beautiful one look at this double glazed windows and what we have we have a beautiful beautiful garden view listen the birds beautiful every window has a net mosquitoes flights screen okay let's go out now and again reminder came from here from the living room now go to the second bedroom which there there is a three absolutely equal size bedrooms again the wardrobe here yeah see the bed beautiful double glazed windows and nice size of a bedroom so you can see how the people owner decided to heat this house this is the pipes comes from the stove below down here on the second living room which i gave you as a, an idea could be used as an office or uh, also another bedroom so these pipes come through here and heat this room absolutely gorgeous make it too much warm every room is with laminate yeah which everyone can change if they want but it's good decisions for the bedrooms you not spend too much in the bedrooms you just sleep and stand up and go out so what's i like it when the people are concentrate more in the in the living room area and yeah which is which is really good and the most of the money people spend is on the living area in the living room area and kitchen and dining and toilet and bathroom are, are the, the best investment for this okay let's have a look at the third bedroom i'll switch on the bathroom and toilet as well this is the third bedroom and let's have a look again it's a proper size one just turn the light on beautiful i like the ceilings look at this typical ceilings and all being kept just painted and treated properly i like it yeah okay so not too much which i personally are going to change if i buy this property you see 
radiators everywhere. This is to be honest, I really enjoy the house as it is because I like the layout, I like the all the locations of the uh, living rooms, I like the options with the downstairs living room and it's very wide, I can feel freedom here, I can breathe, you know, like super. And it's the house space matched with the garden space, you can see. There's not some properties are have a beautiful garden, but there itself the buildings are not too much big and proper size. So sometimes the house is bigger and wider, but the garden is not big. So it's it's always a compromise. But this one here, I think, is a very close to almost not have any compromise with the when you compare the building residential building house with the size of a land. So corridor, first bedroom second bedroom third bedroom and beautiful beautiful toilets and bathroom proper tiles you can see them beautiful sink tiles shower area pellet burner radiator as well look at this it's really good size nice i like it Can have a look and see this. So just opposite we have the access to the living room. You can see. Beautiful. No any wet spots at all on the ceiling, as you can see. Not any. Which means a nice, very good job has been done with the roof insulation and everything. Look at this. Even where the shower area is. No any spots at all. Okay. Okay, so I think you're going to be to surprise of the name of this house video I will going to put. Bye!